Hi guys, this is Jacob. Uh, I just want to make a quick few minute tutorial video on how to properly deploy the AOS CX Switch Simulator so that you can do your own experimentation on Genus 3 with the actual Switch image. There were a lot of confusion regarding this and I love Aruba as much as the next guy but it was very confusing how to set this up and hopefully this tutorial will help you guys out in installing it. So essentially, if you didn't already know, there's an AOS CX Switch Simulator that you go to. You start here. Once you click this, it'll essentially say you want to find how to download the CX Simulator. So downloading it, and it tells you to go here, and you'll need to log in to download it. And once you have this, you'll have a zipped file, right? I already have had the zipped file, and basically I extracted the file to a folder right here and essentially once you extract it you'll have um, an OVA file and a dot OVA dot sig file right and so what they don't tell you is that you'll need 7-zip utility you need to download and install 7-zip and after you install 7-zip you'll have the option to right click the dot OVA file and to 7-zip it and extract to whatever and after you extract it with 7-zip you will actually get the .vmdk file needed for the actual genus 3 in import. Now notice you will also need this aruba hyphen aruba oscx.genus 3a file. Actually you can just do a raw well, and then save as right yep and you can just backspace the dot text on it and you can save that where you guys want it preferably in the same folder as your extract right and so after you've done that you are now in the position where you can open up your genus 3 click file import appliance you can click the aruba hyphen aruba oscx dot genus 3 file click install next and you're now in a position to install your variation of the AOSCX switch using the .vmdk file, you import it, click next, next, and then your file should be good to go and you can now use your Aruba switch. Notice I used the custom icon here. There's There are multiple ways on the internet where you can find icons, but I trust you're smart enough to find that for yourself. If you guys have any additional problems, just let me know in chat and I'll be happy to assist you. Thanks. All right. Bye.